All right, everyone, while we do wait for Speaker Nancy Pelosi, I do want to take you out to Athens, Texas. Sky Fox has arrived on the scene of the school bus versus train accident here. Viewer discretion is advised because we have already learned that one student has died as a result of this crash, so it could be a very bad looking scene here. There you go. The bus is on the tracks right there. You can see that it was essentially T boned on the left hand side of the bus there. It believes, I actually, I'm trying to see where the front of the bus is, either on the left hand side or the right hand side. And the bus is, it's very difficult to make out due to how dark it is out there in Athens, Texas. But you are watching this all unfold live while we wait for Speaker of the House Nancy Pelosi after the U.S. House of Representatives just agreed to the shutdown deal to reopen the government for three weeks through February 15th. All right, everybody, we have just learned that the Nancy Pelosi news conference has been pushed back to 7.30 Eastern. That makes it 5.30 here, Arizona time. It's currently 5.07. So as soon as Nancy Pelosi comes out for that news conference, we'll have it for you here live on News Now, which is a part of fox10phoenix.com. Unfortunately, we are now live in Athens, Texas, taking a look at the aftermath of this school bus crash which so far the Athens Independent School District has confirmed one student has died.
Good evening, everyone. You are watching News Now, which is a part of Fox10Phoenix.com. We are currently live in Athens, Texas, which is just southeast of Dallas, Texas, but North Texas region. Our sister station, Fox 4 Dallas, unfortunately reporting that one student was killed after an Athens Independent School District school bus collided with a train. The crash happened this afternoon around 4.30 local time. They are an hour ahead of us in Texas from those of us here in Arizona. It's currently 5.09, which means it's 6.09 in Texas. Athens School District says one middle school bus was involved in the crash, killing a middle school boy. Actually, excuse me. Athens Independent School District says one middle school boy was killed in the crash. An elementary school girl was injured and rushed to Children's Hospital in Dallas. The bus driver was also taken to a local hospital. No other students were on the bus. Stay with us on air and online for any new information. The Athens Independent School District taken to Facebook to say it is with great sorrow that we confirm one of our precious middle school students lost his life today when a district school bus collided with a train in Athens. One other student on the bus, a female at Central Athens Elementary, was care flighted to Children's in Dallas. The bus driver was transported by ambulance. No other students were on the bus. We ask that you join us in humbly praying for their families. Again, that is a statement from the Athens Independent School District, or ISD, in Texas. When and if we learn anything new about this situation, we'll bring it to you here. But it's just a, a very sad looking scene and a bad crash in Athens, Texas.
They are quickly losing sunlight out there in North Texas, everyone. So Sky Fox will stick around as long as they can. But we are awaiting Speaker of the House Nancy Pelosi's news conference in about 15 minutes after the House has agreed the budget deal to end the government shutdown and at least fund the government temporarily. They call it a CR or continuing resolution through February 15th. So we are expecting to hear from Speaker Pelosi here in just minutes.
Good evening again, everyone. If you're just joining us here on News Now, which is a part of Fox10Phoenix.com, my name is Pilar Arias. On the left hand side of your screen, it's getting a little difficult to see, but our sister station, Fox 4 in North Texas, is reporting a student has been killed after an Athens Independent School District bus collided with a train. The crash happened this afternoon around 4 30 local time. The Athens Independent School District says one middle school boy was killed in the crash. An elementary school girl was injured and rushed to Children's Hospital in Dallas. The bus driver was also taken to a local hospital. No other students were on the bus. The sun has set there in North Texas. Pretty much all we're seeing at this point from Sky Fox is the first responders emergency lights there. On the right hand side of your screen in just moments, we are expecting Speaker of the House Nancy Pelosi to come out here in just a moment and talk about the House vote, which just agreed to reopen the government, the shutdown deal that President Trump announced earlier today that funds the government through February 15th. It's a three-week deal while they can try to hash out an immigration plan for the country. Again, you are watching News Now, which is a part of Fox10Phoenix.com. Whether you are watching on Facebook or YouTube, we appreciate you being here.